Hello my friends and welcome back to our continuing bond let's play the casting of Frank Stone from the world of Dead by Daylight. The Ruthless Failure Run. My name is the Flightless Bird, this is your story basically channel today, we're continuing chapter 8. Mystery Manor. Let's get... Manor Mysteried? Fresh? I mean, I, I thought I was creating a clever pun there, I'm not, I'm not, I'm not. It's so a Ruthless Failure Run, we're gonna fail at creating an intro. Cool, let's go. Hope you're all having a wonderful, fantastic day today. So we begin chapter eight. Miss Castle. Nostalgic, it's been a long time, or shocked. What the heck are you doing here? What the heck happened to your glasses? Were your glasses always like that? How do you see out of those glasses? Uh, shocked. What the hell are you doing here? The film strip, do you have it? <clears throat> hey. Slow down. Uh, excuse me. Sam's just, desperation who are you intimidates exactly? you. Yeah, why'd you come and swing and if you just want to talk? You keep your lying mouth shut and mind your own business. Sam, do I have to mind my own business too, or are you just talking to Stan's lying mouth? Maddie, this is Sam Green, Sheriff of Cedar Hills. Don't think you got much jurisdiction here, Pops. Former Sheriff. Why are you here? You know damn well why I'm here. Former sheriff? Was he always former? I must have forgotten. Oh. <laughs> well, isn't that nice for you? Because I just can't seem to stop cleaning up after your little problem child. Wait, are you talking about the film? Is he talking about the film? Oh, it was a bad move coming here, Linda. That cursed thing should have stayed forgotten. Well, it's going to spell the end of this world. Maybe even every other. Skeptical or concerned? Um, hmm. I don't like concerned, but it does say you're not making a lot of sense, which is great. Skeptical, though, says is more... I'm going to go with concerned because of the second line, not the first. Okay, Sam. You're not making a lot of sense. Are you sure you're okay? You're too old to be running around like a secret agent. <laughs> you're too I'm old. I'm in the best shape of my life. <laughs> And everything I'm telling you is true. All of this is because of what happened back in Cedar Hills. What's happening then, right now. Uh, don't you understand what I'm saying? I... No. I'm sorry. Ugh. Just tell me you still have your piece of the film. Yeah, I still have it. And them? We've all got our pieces. Oh, thank goodness. <laughs> and at least I'm not too late. But... Augustine has made us all an offer. And you turned her down. Right? Uh... Defensive. It's not that simple. Excuse me? It's a very generous offer, and I'm not sure any of us are in a position to turn it down. Are you out of your minds? Of course you are! <laughs> You need to get the hell out of here right now, Linda. All three of you. You take your goddamn film and go. Sam is angry. Yes. Let Linda, that anger what flow is this through guy you. Talking about? The film strip you're carrying pieces of all around with you. It's part of a movie Linda made with her friends. With my son. But it's not just a film. It's, it's a prison. Something far older. Something more powerful than anything humanity's ever conceived. It's, it's pure malignant corruption, and its hunger is unbounding. Oh, okay, Sam. <laughs> Laying it on a bit thick, aren't you? That's pretty rich coming from you, Mr. Stanford. Hold on. You guys know each other? Uh, <laughs> Unfortunately, I have been on the receiving end of the former sheriff's outlandish claims and dramatic interjections for quite some time now. <laughs> Dude is a walking mess. Uh, I got a hand or two. You are looking better than the last time I saw you, yeah? Who's your guy? <laughs> Did this charlatan tell you how he manipulated my son 
and stole his piece of the film when Robert was in a very vulnerable place in his life? I do my business on the level. I'm not out there sneaking around in the dark like some grubby little crook. How is arm? Fuck this. Screw I'm this. Shit, man. I'm done with this. I'm going home. <laughs> not actually going home, but. <laughs> uh, we just went all Cartman there. Him? Why don't you go keep an eye on Stan? I'll stay here. What is with your glasses? I don't remember oh, glasses Darth being like Vader that. Saying, is he for real? I don't know. But I don't think anybody should be wandering off alone right now. Massive huh? corridor. Was this locked before? Hey! Hey, hold up a sec! Stan! Where'd he go? Investigate the television. Yeah, that was weird. He he turned this way. And he disappeared. Like, completely. Why is this here? Now there's a light coming on from this door. Hmm. Stan! You want a bathroom break or something? Stan! Ooh. Here we go. I don't know if because I remember I was stuck on the first one here for a while and And I didn't see anything if you just did nothing here. Okay, that made something happen. That's good. I think. So I'm just gonna go ahead and deactivate the rings here because, like I said, I don't think anything consequential can happen here. Every super rich asshole had a room like this in their house. And on subsequent runs, I can always see if there's something different here. But for now, I'm just going to go through as okay, if we're cooking now. doesn't really do anything. Those ring thingies to go. With the analog secure is kind of weird. I really need to shut this thing down. It like doesn't move the way you think it moves. Just hang in there. I I'm I'm gonna get you out. <sighs> Whatever happened to a good old fashioned on off switch? <laughs> I had the ability to jump there in the cutscene. I hit the X button. And wow, I actually did jump across. Huh. Speedrunning strat right there.
What other switch to stop the bubble that would? So, like I said, I don't think, I don't think there's a timer here. There's no indication that there's a timer here. Come on, Maddie, shut this down before the whole thing goes kaboom. Oh, right, you know what? Let's see let, let, if there is a timer here. Uh, how long would you think, flightless? A minute? Probably. I mean, it depends on how many unique dialogues we get here. But I don't think there is a timer here. Yeah, I don't think there's a timing here. I guess maybe somebody could try or look at the uh, the flowchart. Because if we look at the flowchart, we would see if there's something hidden here. But until, like we, something from a sci -fi flick. I, until we have access to the flowchart, I don't know if we'll see anything here. But if, if there is some way to cause this whole thing to go supernova and just blow everything up, uh, we will be back here and we will see what happens when you blow everything up. Yeah, absolutely. Oh, I could always fail this too. Shit. Okay. Shit. Maybe that's how I blow everything up. I just fail this. bad there I, I'm I'm literally in shock right now I I oh my god that was horrific girl just shriveled up whoa meanwhile it's either hells I like what they did there I'm 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 still shaking a little on that one good god that was that was absolutely freaky as heck. Are you all right? Whoa. Whoa. Shock What's wrong, young man? Uh, nothing. I, uh... Let me help you. Uh, I'm fine. It's nothing. But you look as if something. I'm just looking for my dad. Uh, the sheriff? The sheriff. Yeah. Have you seen him? Oh, well, uh, yes. Uh, where? Uh, here and there, now and then. He does have a way of showing up in the strangest of places. Like how dark the red is in the background. Wait, how long ago was he here? Just, just now or what? Uh, it was more than a minute. Less than a lifetime. <laughs> she is so helpful, isn't she? Uh, sure. Okay, thanks. The pleasure was all mine. I'll be sure to tell him you're looking for him. Still can't believe she just got shriveled up like that. Oh my god. Mystery Man of chapter eight. Whatever happened to that previous chapter? We just see him running away? What what causes that to be different? Pretty sure they came down this way. I uh, wouldn't be sure of anything in this place. How did she get you here, Linda? What did she offer you? You know, out of all the people that expected to die first in this crew, I would expect Maddie to have the most plot armor. And yeah, it looks like you could get her killed off before anyone else. That is crazy. Uh, demanding. Okay, your glasses changed again. Sorry, Sheriff. I think you still owe me some answers. I, I don't know what's going on with the glasses. You're kind of creeping me out, old lady. You're acting like a lunatic. 
Sneaking around? Attacking people? That's not the Sam Green I know. People change over time. The only time I ever saw you even close to this intense was when you caught Chris and Jaime and me at the mill. Jaime? Yeah, Jaime. He was one of your... one of your buddies. You're not okay, are you? Sure he doesn't know Jaime, right? He Which was my means... best friend. You can remember me, but you can't remember Jaime Rivera. Yeah, that's the first indication that he's from a different timeline. Not what it used to be. Find the others. What did you mean when you said all of this is because of Cedar Hills? I said it's because of what happened. <gasps> what is it? Oh, nothing. Nothing. I. Find them all in. Gotta find him before his skies are they're folding in again and it's uh, uh Um let's actually take his gun. Never mind. <laughs> Never mind. Never mind. Take it easy. Over there. I is a this fact, I guess. Although, Sam, I, I did want to kind of complete that one. Okay. We gotta find Augustine now. I think you should take a minute. I'll be fine. Now, are you gonna help me find Augustine, or are you just gonna get in my way? Uh, you're not making it very easy. If you came here expecting me to trust you, then you're not making it very easy. You could have just called me. You didn't have to break in and attack us. I didn't attack you. You know what I mean. Sam is frustrated that we don't trust him. Sam? 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 Hello? Hey, where the hell did you go? Sam, come on! Sheriff Green? That's an examine. It doesn't have the, um... The hold X. Sam! But yeah, we're supposed to go this way. But Sam is frustrated with us, so will we find him here? This is... Certainly something. Bonnie didn't act in this scene. It was Chris. It, this isn't right. Okay, that is not what we shot. Yeah. Augustine has another version of the scene shot by Linda for Murder Mill. I wonder what Terra the main Terra is. You know, our original Terra. Hey, hey, hey. 
Relax. Have you seen all this? What do you mean? Have you seen what Augustine's been doing? Something's wrong. Like, very, very wrong. I think you're starting to see what we're up against. And unfortunately, I'm starting to think we might be too late. Come on. Stop. I'm not taking one more step until you tell me exactly what the fuck is going on here. And don't even think about saying one word short of the absolute truth, you hear me? The truth can be a slippery subject. Sam! Look, I'm sorry, Linda. But I just don't think I'm able to give you what you want. I take no pleasure in any of this. There's no reward for me when I've done what I've got to do. There's no gratitude, no gold watch. It's just sort of a higher calling. <laughs> God, you're so full of it. <laughs> I'm not a kid anymore. And you're not the sheriff. You don't get to play high and mighty with me. Linda. No, you won't be straight with me. Fine, but I'm not an idiot. I know how misdirection works. I can see what you're trying to hide. Did you think I wouldn't notice the second you walked in here? You should be at least 80 years old, but you're barely older than me. How does that make any sense? So what are you implying? I'm saying you might be Sam Green, but you're not the Sam Green I knew in Cedar Hills. You're someone else, aren't you? It's interesting because he still has a lost eye. He still has the damaged arm and you would think oh so it must be the same person but i guess in thousands of universe taken by a there's many universes where you probably have those injuries another reality another world worlds so close they bleed together. but even if that's true it still kind of takes away a little bit about the timelines i chose were special it, it kind of takes the a little word away from the prologue because the if you know that it's not the real Sam, against the edges of our world, you know what I mean? I didn't need Frank Stone's mortal vessel after all. I only needed the most perfect versions of his essence, trapped on celluloid, projected at 24 frames a second. Frank Stone will be reborn. <laughs> Hunting ground, chapter nine. Okay, this is where things might get a little interesting. Well, the whole thing's been interesting. But I mean, I'm really, really looking forward to seeing um what happens when you're when you mess up the camera scenes. Jaime's still here. I have a feeling Jaime's going to die first. I have a feeling Jaime always dies first. Okay. Okay. It's okay. You're gonna be okay. Last time we just ran out Come and we were able to run out okay, but this time we have Jaime with us, so. Can you walk? Yeah. Let's go. I mean, is your lead rest? We actually got relationship points because of that. Like, I think what's gonna happen is Jaime's gonna end up dead. We'll see. If it gives us a chance. It was skip the wagon show with, J with Jaime and Bonnie.
See, Jaime gets up behind, Thanks. so... Ready? I was wondering if this is gonna be, yeah. All right, Jaime. Sorry, until the next universe. So long. Drags him into a fiery pit. Oh no, okay. Oh god, I may That'd have been awesome if he got dragged into the fiery pit and disappeared. Or would have been just like um the the final scene and dragged me to hell. We can't help him, Bonnie. We've gotta leave him. Bonnie, please. He lost good behind me and he was impaled. I should give you two shots to see him. To save him too. I've been thinking about a uh my next run, and I think my next run should be a continuation of this run. Like we go back in House of Madness. We go back to this scene here where we got shriveled up. But this time we don't get shriveled up. And we continue playing. And this time we save Jaime there. But yet we we allow other deaths to happen. <laughs> I don't play for that one. That is that is still unnerving. However, on my um on my redemption run, I'm gonna rewind things too. What did so, I do there? my God, look at this thing. Oh shit! The camera, all that weird light, and oh, I may fuck. Yeah, he's dead. Okay, that's a dead body, right there. That's oh shit. Where the fuck? Is this still can't believe Manny got shriveled up like that. that? That's gotta be one of the more shocking deaths I've seen yet. Who the fuck are you? What is going on in here? <laughs> Wait, wait, please, I need your help. <laughs> it's like, ah. I don't know what just happened to me or where I am. I'm just really scared, and I really have no idea what's going on. I don't know please. either. I was just trying to find a way out of here. Then suddenly there was this, like, thing chasing me, like a, like a presence. A presence? I can't really describe it. It felt like every hair on the back of my neck stood up and committed suicide. When I looked behind me, there was nothing there. Nothing you could see. What are you doing here? Did you come here with the old man? Old man? Sam Green. The sheriff? Uh, sure. He was... No, I, I didn't come with him. Then how did you get here? To the mill? Mill? No, we're... This is a house. No. We're in England. In the country. That doesn't make any sense. You really don't know how you got here. I, I, I was just getting a shot, and, and, and then there was this, like... Weird yeah, because she was an organ, right? Well, that's how you got here. Maybe you can take you back. Is this thing I got a back? Fearful, I don't think I can. So, Fearful, I think, is the best answer here because she seems afraid. Now, at the same time, it would be an opposite thing. Remember when I talked about opposites before? The idea that I do the opposite of what I would have done. Um, because I want to see how would they interact with the new story. So, I'm going to go with fearful. Because that's most... In that's most... 
that's most um what you call it uh in line with our playthrough so far Although we will have to go back and see what happens if we fail sending her back. Oh! Oh my god! Whoa! Augustine. What the heck? Stan just got... Oh my god. We're seeing some really crazy death scenes in today's episode. Oh, Lord, Lord. Chapter 11, all paths must cross. Dude, that was insane. His body just got completely decimated. Actually, I wasn't decimated. Decimation comes from killing off one tenth. That was not one tenth. That was like four six. Or, or like four tenth or two fifths or something. I can't do math right now. It, it was a lot. His legs and arms went flying off. Was that better? Thanks, Doc. Did she get bandaged last time? Oh, oh hey, hey, it's, it's okay. It's okay. We're all gonna die here. There's no yeah. way to escape. Probably. Whenever you see news controlling your fate. It's coming. And every time you successfully do the camera thing, don't you like closing the news? Every time you do the camera thing, don't you like capture his soul into the camera? Nothing there. Nothing to be worried about. You pull from the figure Nothing emerging from the sarcophagus. God, Stan. Dude. Oh, that place back there, that, that thing I came out of. What a crazy trip, man. I I'm gonna wake up any second. I know it. <laughs> Look at her body. See her skin? You can, you can tell she's been a rough through a rough time. That's cool. This way? Run towards the light. Okay, guess not. So we're here. I thought this was a film room. I guess there's a lot of bedrooms. Wow, so here with Chris now. That's different. Oh, and there's the uh is that the talisman? Okay, we need to pick up the book. I want to pick up the talisman. Keepsakes of past victims, which can become protective talismans for those who bear them. How does she know that? Do I take it? Oh. Yes, I'm going to take it. Because I'm curious to see how this either helps or hurts me. And don't forget, we're with Chris. 
So this is different than before. Because Maddie was here before. I have to get the key. Blood sacrifice made elder gods will open up the realm. Do our things still carry over from playthrough to playthrough? Oh, this isn't that thing. I know the, the relics carry over. I don't know if the other M's carry over. I don't even know if the other M's actually do anything. the way out okay let's uh let's go down the uh the second circle of hell here you finally did it chris you fell right into your own freaking movie <laughs> but if i'm in my own freaking movie why don't i know what the fuck is going on Straight down. No. Oh. I did not mean to find that. Dang it, I did not mean to find that. I was trying to, um... This is a twins. We've already found this. Double the freaking... Oh my... Ah, totally forgot about that. This is what I want to see. This is what I was trying to find. I was trying to find this box. So I want to know, okay, so our things do carry over from playthrough to playthrough. And it looks like we missed four of them. I don't want to examine anything that's going to get me clues. There we go. Oh, she made it to the murder room. She the only one left? No, it was Sam and Linda are here, right? You need to understand. Why should I? I don't even know you. How did she recognize Chris. Linda? Linda's changed a lot. Oh boy. I, I don't understand. This, uh, this or maybe she's shocked thing, because of Sam. It, it can happen. Sometimes. Sam, what the fuck is going on here? Christine Gordon picture. That's because it is. You got your piece of the film strip? Yeah. All right, let me see it. What's so important about these film strips? I need to see the actual film. What? Where is it? That is so slick. What happened to Stan's piece? Did, did any of you see it? What happened to it? At least Augustine couldn't have gotten it. Could she? I don't know. I just don't know. Augustine's pulling a lot of strings here. She's been a million miles ahead of us. Hey! You get what you wanted? You done with this fucking game? Why is she making us watch the film? What 
Well, we know Bobby automatically dies. Murder Mill, chapter 13. Is it possible to get Linda in the past to die? God loves to hook people. Wait, isn't that a thing in Dead by Daylight? Like, killers, they put people on hooks? Maybe that's what all the hooks are for. doing Augustine's collected all these different versions of the film all these impossible versions any more of this I, I gotta get out of here I gotta get home We were in the old machine shop. That's where Chris and Jaime and I found a way into Frank's hideout and... That was from... I wonder if you get everyone here killed. Because I don't know a way to get Linda killed. I, I, I tried to get killed but uh, stay right here until I come back do you understand but dad Find the teenagers. Or just teenager. My God, I'm too late. No, no that, that, it's me. It's me. Damn it. I, I told you to. What happened? Wait, I'm coming with you. I gotta help. No, 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 Robert. Whatever is down there is too dangerous. I can't let you get hurt. I can't. But it's my fault. I got them in here. I... If you don't listen to me, I can't protect you. And I just can't trust that you're gonna listen to me. I'm sorry. I wonder if he can change that. No. I'm sorry. Like, I wonder if you can get him to trust Robert so Robert goes with them. Let me know. Comment section below. Huh. Back here. The nightmare repeating itself. I gotta find them. So you could find the camera. Oh, you have to find the camera. It's got the swirling X thing.
But it doesn't mean we have to use the camera properly. Those kids in their damn movie. Linda. All right, where are you, Frank? Coming for you. I'm gonna run right into it, give you a giant hug. If I can figure out where the heck I am. Uh, I'm lost. Yep, I'm kind of lost. Did I get lost here last time? Oh. Something about this camera. We used the key to all of this. This isn't right. It feels like he's here. We're here? I heard a voice come from the right. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, big boy. I'm gonna come right at you. Get ready. Here comes my fist. All right, your fist is faster. Not the most gruesome at deaths, that's for sure. And a lot of it was kind of off screen, which... Oh, he's not dead yet. How did he not get dead? You gotta stop, Stone. That's the most important thing. More than you, more than your friends, more than me. Do you understand? I don't know how, but that camera, it can stop him. Really? Because it didn't, like, there's nothing that you did that let you think that. let him go. Do you understand? Promise me something. Dad, promise me that you finish what I started. Promise me. Promise. Okay, now I was his dad. His eye is suddenly better. Or was his eye always good in the in that timeline? Kind of be interested to see what happens if you let Sam die here, and then you continue on with Robert and you succeed with Robert. Was Robert always here before? I kind of forget. And did it just automatically complete this for me? Yeah, I can't control this. Oh. 
boxing is like a hot potato now. Come on, please let me have a QTE to get the uh, camera. Yes! Yes, this is wonderful! This is very reminiscent to the beginning of the game. You remember when he's crawling to the gun? Kill Robert off screen. <laughs> the heck? Where'd the baby come from? What's going on here? Automatic completed the sequence, but no one died. Use a brick to smash the camera? That's a heck what I would do. Well, that might let him free, too. Is it... is it over? I don't know. I don't think we can be sure. Not yet. So do those two survive no matter what? Is there a way to kill them? Because if there's a way to kill them, I want to... I want to kill them. Maybe it's based on order. Like, certain people can't die. Or there has to be a certain amount of people alive. We're going to finish this today. The second one. I'm kind of shocked by that. The massacre at Garrett Manor. <laughs> Yeah, it's not gonna take long. Oh, his eyes messed up there. Got your damn movie. What more do you want? Time to get out of here. There is no way out of here. And we have to find Maddie. We're not leaving her here. I'm afraid she'll only be dead weight. That's what? Just literally what dead. have you got to say? You heard me. Maddie's dead. Yep. You got a hell of a lot to answer for, and a lot of hell to pay. Comes right through the screen and grabs her. Sam, help me grab her! Dude, she's being choked. You need to hit the hand off. I kind of want to do this just to see if I could do it, but you know, it's the nature of this playthrough. Kind of just gotta Damn fail it. sometimes. By the way, sack. Oh heck! Oh no, we're we're cowards. Injury caused you to lose grip for Chris. Ooh, that's interesting. What is 
that. God, the music's so good. Is Frank Stone? We gotta run now. Well, Emily didn't help at all, did it? Look at her eyes, they glow red for a second there. God, it's freaky. I really want to know if you can get the others killed in the past. Seriously? Shit. That's how we got down here. There's got to be another way out. Why did I think that would suddenly work? I must be losing it. Oh, that's cool. Look at the look at the screen. That's creepy. Blacksmith's hammer. I don't know if I got that before or not. I thought I was just trying to find an item here. Oh, I walked right by it. Now, part of me wants to succeed on this check and then go right, uh, left. And then get killed going left. To see what happens. But because this is our ruthless fight run, I'm going to purposely fail this. Ranks Dr. Lieber and Augustine are one in this scene. Yeah. I I wasn't meaning to pick up evidence, I was trying to pick up this stuff. I can find. Here it is. Part of me also wants to replay this chapter a few times just to see what other variants do. Three strikes are out. Really? Like, that's gonna help. <laughs> Take the chair and just try to bash him over the head. Just slammed her to the ground.
It is ruthless. I am interested where she goes. Considering the elevator's out. Come on, I can't die upstairs. Okay, I'm not upstairs. This is a different room. Oh, that's awesome. Oh shoot, I am upstairs. I can't die here. I've already died here. All right, we gotta succeed this because I've already seen this death. Hopefully there's still a place I can die. It'd be sad if I if my ruthless failure run ended in me failing to die. Ah yes! Alright! Cool! We have a scene that we can die in. Oh you can see a shadow come too. Oh that's so cool. Oh man, Just powered right through that door. Oh! 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 God! I don't know how this game ends when everyone does die. Because I've yet to see that. Reminds me of the Quarry Play 3. Remember that? I had to go through three runs to be able to see the actual ending of the game. Or the uh, the true end of the game. And it looks like Sam goes away no matter what. We can't get Sam killed. You know, I don't think Sam goes away. I think Sam is jumping to a new dimension. Oh, what if we took his diary? What if we took his di diary? Because his diary has the codes. What if we took that so we couldn't leave? Oh, 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 oh. I need to go back to that choice and make a different choice there. I need to go back and make a different choice there because I need to see what happens if we get everyone killed. All right, I know what playthrough, uh, what I'm gonna do next. I, my next video is we're gonna go back and we're going to take that thing from him so we can't escape with it. Maybe we can go back and see uh, the Chris. Is finally the man. The Chris scene as well. To be my champion, a killer worthy of the entity. The bleed between worlds is open, split apart by sacrifice and violence. All will be swallowed by the entity's power. And what of me? The one who served up this world for it to devour. I'll oblige as its faithful servant, existing only to drink in its knowledge, share in its glory. I am Augustine Lieber, and I have brought the entity to your world. I still want to know if there's a way to get past Robert and Chris kill. That's something that's bugging me too. Let me know if there's a way to get them killed because I will absolutely make that happen if I can. Sublime perfection. 
almost unbearably so. I bear to you the offerings. I humbly await my reward for loyal service, unending. What's with the white stuff? Is that glitch? I've never seen that before. Makes it look like a giant marshmallow. I awake, unsure where I am. Then memory floods back, and I know. Our world is gone, consumed by a living realm beyond space, beyond time. Such a cool part of the game. Thanks to me. I love that part. Where we become the killer. They need to make a super massive game like this. Where you become the killer. And you gotta kill off the survivors. I don't know how you would do it, but it would be cool. Whether killing or surviving, the entity will play with our souls for all eternity. An endless hunt of fear and hope, pain and sacrifice from which even death is no escape. And now... Let the trial begin. So cool. All right, we're gonna skip the credits this time because we've already seen them before. I let them fully play through last time. Merciless killer. Madison, Jaime, Chris, Sam, and Linda were killed. Well, it is with this valley run. I mean, that's the way it works. Yep, that is exactly the way it works. Okay, well, I will see you on the flip side. So we saw Augustine Lieber, I think, come out earlier. So, which one comes out? I mean, what, what was the one that came out earlier? You remember the one that uh, Chris ran from? So that's the one that came out earlier, the one, that's her. She's the one that came out earlier. But then who is the new one that comes out? I didn't realize that you actually found the relic by just doing that.
That's such a cool ending. I love it. I love, it. I, I love that part. All right, so what are we going to do on the cutting room floor here? First thing we're going to do is we're going to look at our choices uh, because that's part of the fun. So let us... Let's go to chapter one. All right. I think we went through to chapter three. Okay, well, let's start here because I know I did a lot of this last time. Yeah, Sam failed. So let's start here in chapter two. Uh, so Lonely Road, 25% we drove on. 25% uh, Linda arrived, which makes sense because 25 and 25. Uh, 54 drink declined. Seems the most popular choice. Uh, 37, same defied. 10% the bribe was taken. 8%, so I think that was 9% last time. There's also 1% there. You see the 1%? What What is that? Because it's just going across. Like, what happened here? I, I can't see the other things down there. It's just taking me to the left and to the right. So I'm really not sure what that 1% is. We did the 1% and the 12%. Maybe, like, the different stores you went to? Well, what is this 1%? I, I have no idea. Uh, 27% drugstore chosen first. Yeah, most people choose the curiosity shop. I did. Uh, 38% then went to the curiosity. We haggled the price. And we gifted the mirror. We never really figured out what that did, though. It's kind of disappointing. Uh, let's see. 22% stayed with Maddie. Uh, 7% did something here. I really wish they told you what you did. Info. No, that's just that. Okay, production meeting. 23% uh, skipped all of that. I don't know what we did to skip all of that. Like I said, I wish it would tell you more details. Uh, Chris chose for the group to come again. Like that. Like that, you know, that tells me the details, right? I, I wish there was more of that. Okay, so going up this way, there is a trinket. And then... 27% Chris saved Robert. 90% uh, and then 25% we broke up. The other choices we stayed together. What, what makes you go down this way, though? Like, there's a 3% there. How do you get that 3%? Uh, Jamie Rand? Yeah, not my girlfriend. Um, and right there, there's a death. And I believe that time is death. Not Jamie, sorry. But there is another option here. There's a 13% option here where Jaime doesn't die. And yet, Jaime confronts Frank Stone. Huh. Must be an item or something. All right, 53% went this way. We kicked the intruder. A lot of people do that. In my first playthrough, I didn't. So that should be unlocked. But, you know, it happens. Uh, let's see. 21%. Linda was impaled. It's going to happen on both my playthroughs. 79% did not. And yet, this happened on both of mine. Uh, 5% got Maddie killed. Wow, that's a low percentage there. Maddie fell through the switch and she was killed as Chris arrived in 2024. And then... Archive, archive. Linda watched film. Whoa, 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 whoa. We have a 0% here. My friends. If I could stop doing this thing and actually hit the navigation. We have a 0%. How about that? I don't know what the 0% was, but we have a 0%. And then 100% and 100% and then there's another zero there. But hey, I'm really happy. I love the zero percents. I have no idea what it was we did, but we did something. Uh, let's see. Oh, Descent of the Damned and Hunting Ground. So there's two chapters here. Interesting. Uh, so Jaime was killed while trying to escape Frank Stone. That's an 11%. Uh, most people are the other way. I guess Jaime was already dead. 
Four percent. First found the corpse. Yeah, because you would have to do the rare death to see this. First aid, 52. Uh, Chris going back, 48. Stand crushed versus stand not getting crushed. Uh, wow, 52%. So I'll stay and get crushed. I'm I'm shocked by that. I'm I am shocked this number is so high. So we have a union? Oh, there's a lot of things here that I missed. What is all of this? There's a death here. Whose death is that? There's a lot of stuff here. Corridor? Oh, there's a 0% chance here. Is that zero? Well, how do you get that zero? A uh, couple deaths here in the furnace. Maybe that's Jaime? I'm assuming that's Jaime. Uh, Bonnie's hooked. That's, that's always going to happen. And then we have a screening. And we have a 3% here. I guess that's based on how many people are there. If I look at the picture, who's the guy on the left middle? Like, you see Chris, Linda, Maddie, and Stan. Oh, that must be Sam. So you could have all five there. So I guess the 3% is just having the ones we had. Whoa, just like rocketed up. Uh, storm drain. We had a 13% where Sam died. And then, wow, there's a lot going on here. Uh, Robert weakened stone. So, as Sam dies, Robert automatically weakened stone. And then we have file stand. Linda failed to defeat Frank Stone, and Robert defeated Frank Stone. There are some, there are multiple deaths here, though. So I'm thinking that, I'm I'm thinking that, you had to have two people survive. Yeah, you had to have two people survive. You had to defeat Frank Stone here for Frank Stone to exist in the future. Current call seventy three percent. Chris was consumed by Frank Stone. That is a two percent. Hey, how about that? Gotta love the two percents. A lot of deaths here, too. Uh, hunted six percent into a nine percent. Okay, there's a lot of stuff going on here. Uh, Linda escaped Frank Stone, and then we escaped in the atrium 29 percent. Hey, a one percent. How about that? Look at that. Love these low percentages. And it looks like there is a death scene here. There is some sort of death scene here. So Linda may have multiple deaths on this run. But 86% now come across. And then 51. Interesting. And then there's a 58 here. So I bet you anything, if you take the journal, you can get Sam killed. So this Ruthless Failure Run is not successful because Sam didn't die. I need to get Sam dead. Ninety-four percent, and then there's a six percent choice, whatever that is. Then we have the altar. There's a death here. How is there a death here? How are there deaths here? Well, there's some low percentages here too. Maybe this is if people survive. August and betrayed always happens. Then we have the campfire. And then we have a 22% where nobody escaped. Into the woods. And nobody survived. There's a 1% in there. 2% in there. Look at this web. It's an amazing web.
And I guess this is if one survives, the two survive, the three survive, four survive, and so on. But man, look at all of that. There's like, what, 13 different results here? How the heck do you get all of these? And then, of course, the figure emerges, which is the last thing that happens. All right, my friends. Well, I think what I need to do is I need to figure out where. And I don't know where it is. But I need to figure out where I could have possibly gotten Sam's journal. Because that's what I want to go back to. I want to go back to Sam's journal. Additionally, I think what I'm going to do is restart. Maybe that's where that happened. I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to restart here. Or restart here. I don't know if I have to go here or here. But I, I want to come back here and throw the switch. And after throwing the switch. I, I need to make sure that I get Sam's journal. And then we want to keep Paimi alive here. Because he has already died that way. Again, we want to make sure the deaths are all different. And that's going to set us on a different course. And then we come here and we choose to send her back. And that's going to change our course again. Okay, so there's a couple diversions here coming in the next video. I love you all so very much. Hope you have a wonderful, fantastic, amazing, awesome day. And uh, sorry this video went kind of long, but at the same time, it you know, we had to, we had to wrap everything up. So, yeah, I had, I'm having a lot of fun with this and I can't wait to go back. And now that I know not to start a new game... But to use this screen to play options. Yeah. Um, I'm still a little bit salty. <laughs> but it happens. It happens. You guys have a wonderful, fantastic, amazing, awesome day. And until next time, so long. And take care. Thank you for watching this video. Feel free to comment on what you saw and what you'd like to see next. I always love to hear your thoughts. But before we go, please remember that you matter. And you are brilliant. And you are loved. And you should always be true to yourself. Never let the world tell you any different. Much love to you from your friendly, feathered, flightless bird.